The Great Big Book of Families, written by Mary Hoffman and Ross Asquith, narrated by Teacher Helena. Once upon a time, most families in books look like this. One daddy, one mommy, one little boy, one little girl, one dog, and one cat. But in real life, families come in all sorts of shapes and sizes. In this book, are a lot of families living in different ways. Perhaps there is one that looks like yours. Families. Lots of children live with their mommy and daddy, but lots of others live with just their daddy or just their mommy. Some live with their grandma and grandpa. Some children have two mommies or two daddies, and some are adopted or fostered. Who's in your family? Some people have lots of brothers and sisters and uncles and aunts and cousins and grandmas and grandpas and even great grandmas and great grandpas. But some people have really small families. You can be a family with just two people. Homes. People live in all sorts of homes. Some small families live in big houses, and some big families live in tiny flats. And some people can't find anywhere to live. School. Most children go to school, but some are taught at home, and some just won't go to school. But I've been to school already. I went yesterday. Others are too young to go to school. Holidays. Some families go on exotic holidays and some stay closer to home. Some visit families in other countries and others go on day trips. Not all families can afford a holiday, but most people get some time off from work. Even a weekend at home can be a little holiday. Food. Some moms or dads are great cooks. Others prefer to buy ready-made meals. Most families get their food from shops or markets, but some people grow their own. Pets. Some people believe their pets are members of their family, and some pets think they're very important family members. Some people even look like their pets. Some families can't have pets, but it doesn't stop them from dreaming. And there are ways that every family can have a pet of some sort. Celebrations! Birthdays are fun, but some families make more fuss about them than others. And then there is Christmas, Diwali, Edi, Hanukkah, weddings, christenings, bar and bat mitzvah, Chinese New Year. Whatever you celebrate in your family, there are usually some special traditions. What are we celebrating? Everything! Hobbies. In some families, everyone has the same hobby. In others, everyone likes doing different things. Transportation. Some families walk everywhere, to the shop, to school, to the doctor. Others get about in big cars, or on bicycles, or riding something else. Have you ever tried to make a family tree? Sometimes you don't have to go back far to find bits of family who have come from other countries. And if your mom or dad lives with a new partner, you might have to make a whole new set of branches. Some families can be big, small, happy, sad, rich, poor, loud, quiet, cross, good-tempered, worried, or happy-go-lucky. Most families are all of these things some of the time. What's your like today? The end. And that was the book, The Great Big Book of Families.
written by Mary Hoffman and Ross Asquith.